More than 20 years ago, a 14-year-old boy named Barry Lukaitis walked into his Moses Lake Middle School and opened fire. He killed three people and wounded a fourth before being stopped. Well, today, Lukaitis was back in court, resentenced because of a U.S. Supreme Court ruling in 2012 that said people younger than age 16 could not receive life sentences without parole. KHQ local news reporter Kitty Chen was in court in Efreda, where Lukaitis personally addressed his victims' families. Well, Barry Lukaitis turned around to address the victims' families for the very first time after 20 years, and for some families, what he said brought a little bit of comfort. What I did was weak and was evil and it was senseless. Barry Lukaitis. I'm sorry for what I did. Says this is what he deserves after robbing these families of their loved ones. It doesn't replace what has been taken from you. And you should have it back. For Manny Vela's family, this reopened their wounds. My wife and I sit here today, as we have many other days, wondering what our beautiful son would be doing. Manny's son was one of Lukaitis's victims, and there was speculation about bullying. But today, Lukaitis set the record straight about his son, saying that was not the case at all. He was good. He was better than I am. He always told me it was because I was weak, it was because I was stupid, it was because I was I was jealous, and it's it because I, I just I felt <clears throat> like I was. Like, I was a good person and other people weren't. Manny Vela says it has brought some peace. That's the best thing that could have come out of all of this is, is uh, him saying what we've known all along, that he was not a bully, that he was not the bad example that he was first set out to be, that my son was a good man. Lukaitis also asked the judge to waive all future appeals so the families won't have to go through this again. In Afreda, Katie Chen, KHQ Local News.